put it in his place and be a vindicated prophet, they'll believe it. Right. I was talking to a Jew up here at Benton Harbor when that John Ryan being blind all of his life nearly received his sight. They take me over there to that house of David and this uh, uh, rabbi come out with his long beard. He said, but what authority did you give John Ryan his sight? I said, in the name of Jesus Christ, the Son of God. He said, far be it from God having a son. See? And uh, he said, uh, you people can't cut God in three pieces and give him to a Jew. Make three gods out of him. You're a bunch of heathens. I said, I don't cut him in three pieces. Amen. Amen. I said, Rabbi, would it be a strange thing for you to believe one of your prophets told something wrong? He said, our prophets don't tell nothing wrong. I said, who was Isaiah 9 and 6 speaking of? He said, the Messiah. I said, then Messiah will be a man prophet. Is that right? I said, yes, sir. That's right. I said, show me where Jesus missed it. He said, I said, what relation will Messiah prophet be to God? He said, he will be God. And I Amen. said, that's right. Now you got no head. So help me. That Jew standing there and the tears rolling off his cheeks said, I'll hear you sometime later. I said, Rabbi, you believe that? And he said, look, he said, God is able these stones to rise children to Abraham. I know it is in the New Testament. I said, right, Rabbi. Now what about it? He said, if I preach that, I'd be down there. You know where the place sits on the hill there? Down there in the street begging my bread. I said, I would rather be down there begging my bread. Amen. The Jew still got his hands on money, you know. Yeah. I'd written his name and gold on the... I said, I'd rather be down there eating salty crackers and drinking branch water. And know that I was in the harmony with God, the Amen. truth, than it would be here with my name on that building and gold letters like that and know that I was away from God. Amen. I know that. Amen. He wouldn't listen to me no more. So he went in, that's it. You can't cut God no two or three pieces called Father, Son, and Holy Ghost and make three gods and hand it to a Jew. This very commandment is thou shalt have no other gods before me. I'm the Lord thy God. Amen. What did Jesus say? Jesus said, Hear you, O Israel. I'm the Lord your God, one God. Amen. Not three. You'll never give that to them. No, no prophet will ever talk about three gods. Amen. <laughs> Amen. No, you never hear that. No, sir. That's pagan and heathen is where it comes from. Yes. <laughs> Notice, but these prophets will come. Not only that, the, the prophets now is Revelations 11. We've read some of it. I want you to read as you study on the tapes and so forth. They are absolutely vindicated prophets by the sign of prophets. Then Israel's going to hear that. Now, do you, my Jehovah?